Are you still relying on eye drops to relieve your eye discomfort? What if I told you they might be doing more harm than good? In today's video, we're revealing seven ways eye drops can damage your eyes, backed by scientific evidence. If you've been wondering, can eye drops cause more problems than they solve? What are the dangers of long-term eye drop use? What should I be doing instead to protect my eyes naturally? Stick around because we're going to exceed your expectations and give you alternatives to maintain healthy eyes without risking long-term damage. Before we get into the first issue, make sure to subscribe for more informative Upwell content. We sincerely appreciate it. Issue 1. Rebound Redness Over Use of Decongestant Eye Drops did you know that the drops you're using to reduce eye redness could actually be making it worse? Millions of people use decongestant eye drops to reduce redness and get that bright-eyed look. These drops shrink the blood vessels in your eyes, temporarily removing the red appearance. However, overusing them leads to a cycle known as rebound redness, where your eyes become dependent on the drops to stay white. After the drops wear off, your blood vessels expand again, sometimes becoming even more dilated than before, making the redness worse. This is because your eyes are trying to compensate for the extreme constriction caused by the drops. A study published in the Journal of the American Academy of Ophthalmology highlights the risks of long-term use, showing that frequent application of these drops can cause more severe eye irritation blood vessel damage, and sensitivity over time. The more you use the drops, the more reliant your eyes become on them to maintain a white appearance. As a result, what started as an occasional use can quickly turn into a daily harmful habit. The best course of action is to treat the underlying cause of your redness, whether it's allergies, dry eye syndrome, or eye strain. Targeting the root issue can eliminate the need for harmful decongestant drops. Speak to an eye care professional to explore alternative treatments, such as lubricating eye drops, allergy medications, or lifestyle adjustments, like reducing screen time, which can prevent future redness without causing long-term damage. Issue 2. Preservatives and eye drops can irritate your eyes. Think your eye drops are helping? They might be harming your eyes due to hidden preservatives. Most over-the-counter eye drops contain preservatives like Benzylconium chloride, BAK. These chemicals extend the shelf life of the product, but they come with a significant downside. Preservatives are designed to prevent bacterial growth in the bottle, but when used frequently, they can irritate the eyes, inflame the cornea, and disrupt the natural tear film that protects your eyes. Over time, these preservatives accumulate on the surface of the eye, leading to irritation and damage. Research in the International Journal of Ophthalmology shows that chronic exposure to BAK can damage the corneal epithelial cells, which are crucial for maintaining healthy, clear vision. In people with pre-existing conditions, like dry eye syndrome or allergies, the effects can be even worse, causing severe discomfort, persistent redness, and an increased risk of infection. Additionally, BAK can break down the lipid layer of the tear film, which leads to quicker evaporation of tears, further exacerbating dry eye symptoms. If you're using eye drops frequently, it's essential to switch to preservative-free alternatives, especially for conditions like chronic dry eye or glaucoma. Coma. Preservative free drops come in single use vials to eliminate the need for chemicals that extend shelf life. These options are gentler on your eyes and safer for long term use, ensuring that your eyes get relief without the risk of irritation or long term damage from chemical preservatives. Issue 3 Masking Underlying Problems Are your eye drops masking a bigger issue that you should be treating? Eye drops are often viewed as a simple solution for eye discomfort, but they can be deceptive. By using drops to alleviate symptoms like dryness, irritation, or redness, you may unknowingly be covering up more serious eye conditions that require medical attention. For instance, chronic dry eye syndrome is often mistaken for temporary discomfort, but it can lead to inflammation, corneal damage, and vision loss if left untreated. Similarly, infections, inflammation, or even glaucoma can manifest as mild irritation or redness, which eye drops may temporarily relieve. The American Optometric Association points out that using over-the-counter eye drops as a stopgap measure can delay critical diagnoses and proper treatments. Eye drops can provide temporary relief, but they don't address the root cause of the symptoms. In the case of infections, 
Redness relief drops might reduce inflammation for a short time, but without antibiotics or antifungal treatments, the underlying condition will continue to progress, potentially causing lasting harm. If you're experiencing ongoing eye discomfort, it's vital to consult with an eye doctor rather than self-treating with over-the-counter drops. A thorough eye exam can uncover the true cause of your symptoms, whether it's an infection, inflammation, or a chronic condition like glaucoma. Once diagnosed, you'll be able to receive the right treatment and avoid the long-term risks of masking the problem with eye drops. Issue 4. Disruption of Natural Tear Production Could your eye drops be interfering with your body's ability to naturally lubricate your eyes? Artificial tears are designed to supplement the moisture in your eyes, mimicking the natural tear film. However, regular use of these drops can disrupt your body's ability to produce its own natural tears. This is because your eyes may become reliant on the external source of moisture, leading to a lacrimal insufficiency, a condition where your eyes produce fewer natural tears over time. A study published in the Journal of Clinical Ophthalmology explored this feedback loop, revealing that overusing artificial teardrops can interfere with the natural tear production process. While the drops provide short-term relief, they don't address the underlying issue of why your eyes are dry in the first place. Over time, the tear glands may produce fewer tears, and your eyes will rely more and more on artificial sources of moisture, worsening dryness and discomfort in the long run. Instead of over-relying on artificial tears, it's essential to take steps to improve your natural tear production. Staying hydrated, eating a diet rich in omega-3 fatty acids, and using a humidifier can help boost moisture levels in your eyes. If your eyes are still dry, consider talking to your doctor about treatments like punctal plugs or prescription eye drops that stimulate tear production without causing dependency. Issue 5. Blurred Vision and Sensitivity do your eye drops leave you with blurred vision or make your eyes more sensitive? Some types of medicated eye drops, such as those for allergies or glaucoma, can cause temporary side effects like blurred vision or increased sensitivity to light. For example, allergy drops that contain antihistamines can dry out the eyes, while glaucoma drops that dilate or constrict the pupils can change how your eyes focus, leading to temporary vision disturbances. A report in the British Journal of Ophthalmology revealed that patients using glaucoma drops containing beta blockers or prostaglandin analogs often experience temporary side effects such as blurred vision, eye discomfort, or increased sensitivity to light. While these effects usually subside after a few hours, long-term use of these medications can cause more permanent issues like dry eyes or corneal thinning. If you're experiencing these side effects, it's essential to consult your doctor. They may be able to adjust your dosage, recommend an alternative treatment, or suggest lifestyle changes such as wearing sunglasses to reduce light sensitivity. Ensuring you're using the right type of drops with the least side effects can protect your eyes and your quality of life. Issue 6. Allergic Reactions Could your eye drops be the reason your eyes are itching, swelling, or turning red? Allergic reactions to eye drops are surprisingly common, especially when the drops contain preservatives, stabilizers, or certain chemicals designed to treat allergies. For example, some allergy eye drops contain ingredients that can cause more irritation than relief, leading to symptoms like redness, itching, and swelling. In a study, published in Clinical and Experimental Ophthalmology, researchers found that patients using over-the-counter allergy drops were often making their symptoms worse due to allergic reactions to the drops themselves. In some cases, these reactions can lead to allergic conjunctivitis, a condition that causes extreme swelling, redness, and discomfort. The preservatives used in multi-dose bottles of eye drops are frequently the culprits, causing long-term irritation and worsening allergic responses. If if you suspect your eye drops are causing an allergic reaction, stop using them immediately and switch to preservative-free or hypoallergenic options. Consult with an eye specialist to determine if the ingredients in your drops are triggering the reaction. Making the switch to a gentler formula can often resolve the issue and provide the relief you're seeking without exacerbating symptoms. Issue 7. Risk of Contamination could your eye drops be contaminated with bacteria without you even knowing? 
Eye drop bottles can easily become contaminated if they're not handled properly. If the tip of the bottle touches your eye, skin, or any other surface, bacteria can enter the solution, potentially leading to infections like conjunctivitis. Even if you're careful, multi-dose bottles that are used over long periods pose a higher risk of contamination, as each opening exposes the solution to airborne particles and bacteria. The American Journal of Ophthalmology reported that improper use of eye drops is a common cause of bacterial eye infections. Even minor contamination can lead to infections that require medical treatment, particularly in people who are already prone to eye conditions. This is especially concerning for people using medicated eye drops for chronic conditions like glaucoma, as the long-term use of contaminated drops can cause recurring infections. To prevent contamination, make sure to handle eye drop bottles with clean hands. Avoid touching the tip to any surface and store them properly. Consider switching to single-use vials, which eliminate the risk of bacterial growth inside the bottle and reduce the chances of long-term contamination. Eye drops may seem like a quick fix, but they can lead to long-term damage if not used properly. To protect your vision and avoid these risks, check out our next video on the best eight herbs for eyesight. We'll cover more natural, evidence-backed ways to support your eye health. See you there.